love to last. Has any, Don't we believe in love anymore? Adam, has anyone sat <laughs> Let's down Let's rip with up you? all contracts. Has anyone sat down with you and said, Adam, I love you? I don't want to talk about it. It's so early. Have, so I, have, I, have, I, have any, I don't know what you're talking about. What's a prenuptial <laughs> agreement? What the fuck could you... Why, you know, no, no one... You know, look, you can't leave... The, it's part of life, unfortunately. You know, We've all been through it. Yeah. Is Christina Aguilera invited to the no wedding? No comment. Is, um, who is invited to the wedding? You, I you. want to know what famous people are invited. Thanks for, thanks for seeing me squirm and changing the subject. Oh, no. um, yeah. well, I look like you, it looked like you were not answering. No, I just talk a lot. I, you must, I, you're used to it now, but like I've said a lot of shit lately and just gotten in trouble for some reason. I'll tell and, you what you got in trouble for because it was ridiculous. Oh, God. I'll, I'll yeah, tell you yeah. two things you got in trouble. Then we're going to get back to the prenup. I need to just shut up. I'm just not going to talk about No, anymore. I'll tell you why, Adam. You said nothing wrong. I, I follow what you did. First of all, you uh, talked about the fact that you went out. Now, now, I don't have a problem with this. You uh, called wait, up. Are your... you are you going to lay down judgment right now? Okay, yeah, I like. Okay, I'm okay. going okay. to judge okay, you. Okay, okay, I like it. I like well, why not? Everyone else does. <laughs> yeah. I, no. uh, <laughs> and by the way, why did you dye your hair blonde for a while? I'm glad it's back to what it is. Because I was bored. You're the world's best looking guy, according to People Magazine. Why the fuck would you fuck that up? If I had your I looks, like I wouldn't it. touch. Stop it. It's back to normal. You sound like my father. Now, uh, that's right. <laughs> Jesus. Why, your father saw your blonde hair and said, what are you doing? You're my, on a roll. My dad liked it. <clears throat> my dad's the only one that liked it. Uh, James, what did you think of the uh, blonde hair? Hey, we're talking about it right now, aren't we? Uh, you know, I think it worked out. You don't care as long as he keeps... I didn't do it for gag. As long as I he did. keeps on singing, I don't care. <laughs> yeah, do whatever you want. <laughs> it's like, you, you do whatever you want, man. <laughs> uh, you recently said you called up all your ex-girlfriends. I did not say that. Yeah, that was total didn't. fabrication. I, you I, didn't Clear the that? record. 100% did not do... I'd like okay. to clear the record right now. I definitely didn't do that. That was a really surprising thing to have heard to have come out because I, I literally have no idea. What so, the hell how does something like that get started, Adam? I do not know. The, the rumor was, I guess, that you had picked up the phone and called each of your girlfriends to apologize for your ways with them. Completely untrue. Uh, and, like and, completely, one hundred percent untrue. Why won't I don't do even that? I don't know. It sounds like a fantastic <laughs> idea. It's not like, and that was so weird too. Is the angle on it was. That it like wasn't totally cool to have done that. Even I, I kind of no, wish I, I had just, done that. I just it would have been really nice. Why not? When you're getting, when you're engaged and you're getting married, an old girlfriend doesn't want to hear. And it's kind of arrogant to like call. Right. It's so selfish and arrogant to like yeah. call. Sorry, it didn't work out between us because right. you're not good enough you for lost, me. Right. You yeah. lost the sweepstakes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like what am I going to say to somebody? Like, uh, well, so so uh, it's kind of uh, fucked up to do that actually. I mean, that's what. So maybe it's good that you're here to dispel that i mean uh i just don't care i just don't pay attention because it's you know that it's all nonsense 99 percent of the shit that people say about you is either some sort of contortion of the but truth that's a major that seems like thing. something nobody would be able to make up yeah i mean that just seems so out of the blue yeah but you don't need any source to do anything anymore now now it, 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 back in the day at least there was like there needed to be like some credibility to the right. rumor now someone can just literally say whatever they want and put it out there and it's 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 fine are you friends with any of the women that you previously uh, dated or does it all sort of end like hey let's not talk to each other i don't know how dudes are friends with girls that they used to be with <laughs> I, that's, i'm not like i don't get down with that at all i, I don't know right. how they, people do that it's like i used to have sex with this person all and and hang out with them intimately and i how do you go from that to being best friend it, the people who are super close with with their exes is the weird thing to me yeah, like, I, I agree it's like kind of emasculating or something yeah. in a weird way because then they got to, you have to deal with them dating people and you're like and their friend you, yeah and it's like Ugh. and right. wouldn't you be upset if your fiance for example was busy calling up her old boyfriends and saying hey we're still friends would you have a problem with that i think there's a difference i think there's if like mm. casual acquaintance uh, a cup of coffee once a year or something like that. Really? Okay. You're okay with that? I don't that? care with that, about that. I would care about, like, if they were deep, if they were, for, like, friends and were close. Then I was like, oh, if this is the person that my significant other is going to go to when she needs to talk to someone. Like, yeah. That's bullshit. That should be me. Kind of thing. Right. I wouldn't be happy about that. If there was a real close relationship, but no, neither one of us have that. And, and in your relationship, uh, you, you know, oh, oh, so I was going to talk about some of the things you were controversial. Oh, great. You, you, you did an interview, I think it was for Rolling Stone. You were talking about the voice. And I thought you said a very honest thing. You I said, did. Yeah, you said, look, um, uh, if you want to talk about the voice, uh, it disappoints me or it disappoints the show that we haven't had a Kelly Clarkson come out of there or one of these uh, bigger. That would be. You, 
that would be a really great thing. Yes, but you and know how it works. A criticism. Because you, but you know how these guys are. God bless them. It doesn't. The truth. That is the truth. Right. And I stand by that. Mm-hmm. I do. I am saddened by the fact that we haven't done that yet. It's very hard to do. Sure. And that's. I think. I don't know if I said enough of that. It wasn't a particularly balanced quote. That. And by the way, there were probably ten sentences before and after that that they didn't use. They took that one little snippet. You know how these guys are. They're, I think they're really well intentioned, but they don't want you to ever draw attention to something that isn't perfect about right. a big network television show. Right. It's like if you got on and did an interview about AGT and you were like, "Yeah, like it's cool, it's kind of lame, but it's so much fun." That if you said that about it, they would say, "Why did you say it was lame?" Now it's all over the tablet. You know, right. they'll take whatever. Like that's not like I wouldn't care if I, if someone says I was oh he must have a good time. By the way, it's not lame. It's a great show. By the way, I don't want yeah, to no, no, but, great, but if yeah. you said something like of that nature, I guess they might they latch on it. to that yes. and, and don't ever say anything that's making us look weak. That's what they were upset about, and I understand that. But I was also kind of trying to be truthful and, and get get us to actually get in the position where we could launch well, the point a big of the, star. The, you the know? Voice is a big game changer for NBC. This show has literally single handedly saved the network, hasn't it? I mean, let's I be know. honest. So, I mean, I guess they're looking for you to do something wrong, you know, people are out to get you. Who is going to be your... uh, Christina Aguilera is off the show now and it's going to be Gwen Stefani. Gwen and and Pharrell. Now, I think uh, Gwen and Pharrell are major uh, finds for the show, right? It's a big deal. Like, the coolest thing. I, I, you know, we just shot the uh, blind auditions for the the seventh season, so we we work together already. They are so... It's I would say by far the best thing we've ever done on the show. It's the best television we've ever made. I know, when Pharrell was in here, he was really excited about doing it. Oh, and he hadn't done it yet. Pharrell's a genius, right? The Pharrell Pharrell interview was amazing, by the way. That was was awesome. By the way, James, by the way, he, he, he wasn't not a fan, Like, but now... You have like fucking major super fans. I, I got a car with Siri. I, I like to so say, I like it's to say, amazing. I converted, for, I converted James. Yes, but, but James <laughs> Farrell, you're right. Farrell is a guy who is sort of behind the scenes, even though he had a hit with Happy and yeah, all that. Yeah. But but this guy is a brilliant guy. Now I would imagine when, when he criticizes a singer, he knows what the fuck he's talking about. All of you do. Uh, Gwen Stefani's had a massive career. Were you surprised she agreed to do it? They were kind of my, because when we, you know, it's we've had obviously a rotating cast for a while, and she was like, those two were like, I couldn't have a more of a dream, uh, two people. I, I literally, I, I thought to myself, this is the greatest thing ever. I'm so happy. I had talked to the producers about it, and I had talked about them specifically, but I was like, it's a pipe dream. There's I think she's happen. a very sexy woman, this Gwen Stefani. Oh, she's beautiful. She's Gwen Stefani. Does she like, wear hot on. outfits this season? Do, 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 I mean, sometimes it disappoints me when these women, these hot women, do come on and they dress like their grandmother. But Christina didn't disappoint you. She was like, all the time, boobs out. Yeah, crazy. but she lost the weight. I appreciated it. I, I mean, who wants to see her all chubby? It's a mess. <laughs> I mean, seriously. I mean, she looked fantastic, didn't she? Yeah, she did. She did look she did. fantastic. And Gwen Stefani. Stefani is a, a, a trendsetter. I would think she would dress up in all these wild outfits and things. Gwen couldn't really wrap her head around the idea that I was just such... I kind of fanned out on her a little bit. Like, I kind of fangirled on her a little bit. I was like, I love your band so much. It's crazy. Because like, we grew up going to see No Doubt shows when we were kids. You know? And then she's like... I think she's so amazing and it's so cool I told the producer I was like you better put her next to me isn't I, that the, isn't I, I want to talk to her the whole time isn't that the hard part though of getting married if you meet so I mean especially in show business I'm, I'm busting your balls but you you meet like a woman Gwen's married but I'm saying married and has three kids yes I understand <laughs> but I'm saying you meet so many exciting women like her I mean in show business and singers and this and that the, 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 it is just massive temptation in your position yeah I mean I don't think as a man you ever stop being really attracted to women. And I don't think that it's not. Well, I don't, what are you going to do? Nothing. Because, <laughs> no, How like are seriously. You going to listen, five years in. I'm yeah, what now. are you going to do? You've been banging the same chick five years. My, let, me, 